Hello and welcome to episode 5 of Burns Banter, the podcast that takes a fresh look at the life and works of Robert Burns, hosted by myself, Alistair Turnbull. In this episode, we're going to look at a poem called My Heart is in the Highlands. It's a fairly simple poem, easy to understand, not many old Scots words in it. So uh, if you've been invited to a Burns night, this would be a good poem for you to recite if you've been asked to recite a poem. It's easy to read and it's easy for people to understand. So in this episode, I'm going to tell you a little bit about the poem, recite the poem and then tell you a little bit more. I don't even need to recite a modern translation because there isn't that many old Scots words in it. So let's look at the poem. Okay, the poem, uh, which is also a song as well, was written in 1789 by Robert. And 1789, he was working on a farm called Ellerslind, and he'd also started working as an excise man. I think he's been working quite a lot, and uh, things weren't going particularly great. And I think he wrote this poem because he wanted to be somewhere else, like we often do when we're having a bit of a hard time, you pardon me, you want to be somewhere else that's better, somewhere you want. So for Robert, that was the Highlands of Scotland. So he wrote this poem, uh, this poem called My Heart's in the Highlands. So I uh, let's go ahead and read the poem. My Heart is in the Highlands, a poem and a song written by Robert Burns in 1789. My heart's in the highlands, my heart is not here. My heart's in the highlands, a chasing the deer. Chasing the wild deer and following the roe. My heart's in the highlands, wherever I go. Farewell to the highlands, farewell to the north. The birthplace of valour, the country of worth. Wherever I wander, wherever I rove. The hills of the highlands, forever I love. My heart's in the highlands, my heart is not here. My heart's in the highlands, a chasing the deer. Chasing the wild deer and following the roe. My heart's in the highlands, wherever I go. Farewell to the mountains, high covered with snow. Farewell to the straths and green valleys below. Farewell to the forests and wild hanging woods. Farewell to the torrents and loud pouring floods. My heart's in the highlands, my heart is not here. My heart's in the highlands, are chasing the deer, chasing the wild deer and following the roe. My heart's in the highlands, wherever I go. A simple poem of longing to be in the highlands. And as I said, an easy one to read and an easy one to understand. There is a couple of words in there that I might have to explain to you. Uh, Wherever I rove, to rove is basically to wander, to journey with no particular place in mind. You just wander all over the place. That's to rove. Robert used to rove around the hills uh, looking for inspiration, you know, wander. A wild deer is just a wild deer. A roe is a a medium-sized deer. It's a bit kind of smaller than a big wild stag. Uh, A strath, it says, very all to the straths and green valleys below. A strath is actually just a a wide valley in Scotland. It's called a strath. Uh, Apart from that, there's not much else to learn about this poem. It's, as I say, easy to read, easy to understand, A great starter poem for you if you're going to a Burns night. And I hope you do, and I hope you recite it. Until the next episode, Slanjava. Slanjava.